up, guys? Hello, YouTube. So, we're going to do a very, very short series of interesting videos before we leave Japan based on these little children's candy make making. Yeah, candy sets. making kits. When I was a kid, I had like the Easy Bake Oven and the Mrs. Fields Baking Factory. Mrs. And Fields Baking Factory. And the Baskin Robbins Ice Cream Maker and I had all of them. So I've always been like really fascinated by these like cheap little Japanese versions, and my cat appears fascinated as well. I'm actually kind of interested in, in them as well, but from a purely chemical standpoint. They are interesting. Um, the main brand of these seems to be Poppin' Cookin'. At least that's the one I find the most on YouTube videos. Poppin' Cookin'! So like, we'll do all of them in separate videos, but for today, we're going to start on this takoyaki creation one. The front of it just shows like a basic thing of what it is. It looks like it's got the outside of the takoyaki is peach flavored jelly and the inside is like little octopus bits made of strawberry gummy. What the hell? And then there's the little topping crunchy things and then there's caramel sauce that forms the takoyaki sauce. And then the back here just has like all the little instructions that you need. Let's go ahead and open this up. Let's try not to tear our instructions in half. <laughs> so it's got a little tray that you can tear and perforate. You've got, oh they pre-made you the little octopus gummies. That's kind of yes. sad. It's okay, we've got other gummy kits. This is the... Sauce? Yeah, caramel sauce. These are the topping crunchies. So we've got our little mixy spoon. Oh goodness. Our little takoyaki mold. <laughs> And here is our mix. Open up our main takoyaki jelly powder. I'm gonna pour that. Whew! There's a lot of that. Oh, oh! I was supposed to put water in, in there, there first. first. Let's go ahead and try to put that pour back. that back in because I'm one of those brats that doesn't read the instructions <laughs> first. All right. So it says to fill up to that bottom line. With water. Check. Then we pour in the powder. Alright, let's get some like good shots of that powder going in. Oh, oh, you look... You look disturbing. Oh, you look great. <laughs> and then mix this up. I think this looks solidified enough now. Or at least mixed well enough. Alright, then it says to take your teeny tiny spoon that like, for size comparison, here is it to my nose. <laughs> <laughs> and it wants you to use this. Film is <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> so like, we're gonna be here for the next six hours. Okay, so now that we've got these kind of filled, we go ahead and throw in our octopus gummies. Octopus gummies. You can see they've got, they're either shaped like little tentacles. One of them is just like a full on. A straight up octopus. Cute little octopus. <laughs> what monstrosity are we creating? One that traps octopuses forever in a peach prison. <sighs> peach. This is, this is what Princess Peach is actually doing. Every time she gets kidnapped by Bowser, this is her job. All right, and then we just use the rest of it to cover, I guess. Not sure how this is gonna make circles by the time we're done. I don't believe that these are going to make circles. I'm going to call this now. I'm not Japanese enough <laughs> to properly construct this kit. Oh, what even is this, Mary? <laughs> this is a nightmare. I went from commentating on the Japanese education system to spooning snot-looking peach jelly into... <laughs> <laughs> the circle mold. Now over here, it does say like using your spoon, you should try to flip them over. What? Mary, don't eat the stuff before it fucking hardens. <laughs> Why shouldn't I? Okay, so now in the interest of gender equality, we're going to let Vincent do this last bit. Yeah. You actually have to flip the stupid things. So we're gonna try to shit fucking dick balls. Stupid, grunt thundering, blast, smegging. So now we're ready to sit down and eat. We have the only appropriate accompanying product. We've got this Pokemon Shanberry. Pokemon Shanberry. I hope it's not actually like 
you know, magic card blood or something. What the hell? Oh, it doesn't even come with, like, Pokemon on the bottle. What a... What a... What a... What a... This is... This is a ripoff. Shangri Pokemon drink. Now at your local Pokemon Center. Hi! Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Shall we take care of your Pokemon? In the meantime, do you want one of these terrifying snot balls? I don't want to touch it! Here, here. Look at her face! <laughs> They're not bad! It's just really hard to chew all the way through, like real takoyaki. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Oh, that outside jelly shit is- Shall we have some Pokemon? Oh man, I hope that this shit isn't awful too. Pokemon wine? Here we go. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> this was a failure on all accounts. What are you? <laughs> so we'll have you guys vote on which one we make tomorrow night. So we've got this strange proto ice cream type thing. It's probably going to be like Caplico treats, where it's kind of like the consistency of styrofoam. <laughs> We've got the Super Giga Death Mode gummy mixture thing, which has like shapes and devices and full palette. And shit inside. Maybe we'll save that one for last. And then right. we got this sort of like basic sea creature gummy kit thing. So then, we're going to attempt to finish the rest of this Pokemon wine. This last one is yours. Bye-bye! Bye. Oh, what even is this, Mary? <laughs> this is a nightmare.